guys, Jibs here. I'm pretty tired, but it's pretty cool. I got second place at my uh, RDB's S tournament at my local local city tonight, whatever. Uh, so I thought it would be pretty cool that I'll show you a second place deck profile that I won with. Uh, this deck could be better than what it is, but for what it's worth, I did really well. Uh, my matchups were. Vachito, red, blue, Vachito, uh, was, uh, Mecha Frieza, the GT combination Mecha Frieza deck that's really good right now. Uh, it was, uh, Android 17-18 duo Android deck, and then it was a, um, yellow, blue, black, uh, golden Frieza deck. Yeah, so I went 3-1, I won the first three rounds, and I lost to the Frieza deck. I went 2-1, uh, two, two the Frichito, 2-1, the Mecha Frieza, 2-0, the seven, Android 17-18, and I got 2 old by the Frieza deck, because the hand blockers, and, and I'll, the, he had so much draw power and so much hand advantage that I, I just couldn't keep up. So, yeah, this is the deck I played. I played... Uh, Mass Saiyan, Black Red, Aggressive deck. Essentially, uh, I think y'all know what he does. Mills 3 gets crit. If he hits a red or black, he gets critical and or 5,000 boost. If he hits a black, it's critical. If it's both, if it's any other color, really, it's 5,000. I'm playing red, so if he hits red, for me, it's 5,000 and critical. Then 4 life less, you draw to awaken. Then Bardock's percent 3. He does essentially the same thing. But this time when you swings, you draw a card, which I actually missed that a lot, auto a lot. I missed it because, I don't know, I did it, uh, I didn't use it as much as I did wanted to because I don't I just forgot or I wasn't paying attention or whatever. But yeah, that's the leader. I'm going by, uh, cost. So, yeah, uh, oop. This is all upside down. Oops. My bad. Okay, we're good now. Okay, it's gonna go by cost. So fine with the one drops. Uh, four, four Kaba because Kaba's real. You know, Kaba's double strike. You want to be aggressive, so Kaba's. Uh, playing a Champa engine for more aggressiveness. So I'm playing four manipulating God Champa one drop. Search stop seven for a Champa, pretty simple explanatory. I'm playing for Toa, add a Mira or Mass Sand. I'm running uh, some Miras and of course the Mass Sand from the starter deck. So yeah, I'm running her for, but I did miss miss a couple times with her today, but that's okay. The two drops are, the only one is the 10K, 10K boost draw, cause yeah, it's self explanatory. On to the uh, three drops. I'm not really gonna explain everything in detail because I'm pretty tired. It's late, but I just wanted to get this out, get this out because um, second place is pretty cool. And it, so essentially, this deck did really well. Four power or mirror because this guy is just way too free for a 25k body and power. It's just so too good. And if you give him double strike with the other, with the um. The double striking trompa is that's really really powerful. Uh, three of the I don't know, I think assault trunks. Uh, I thought two wasn't enough because you have a chance to mill them. Still, and it's like I want to be able to have more better odds of, of them, and I couldn't find room for four, so I fought two, put three, because he's really good. Because when you when you when you go through your warp. You bring them back, so your hand. So it's pretty useful, pretty, pretty good, pretty useful. Uh, I played a uh, hard, hard attacker motion. She, she only came up a couple of times. It's because uh, green and yellow, especially yellow, are pretty popular. I know the Mega Frieza, so I played her as a tech in the deck. Cause I didn't have a side deck. Cause I didn't know we. I didn't. Yeah, I came up prepared. But it's whatever. Uh, nobody, nobody had a side deck today, anyways. So it wasn't really that big a deal. 
So you didn't really come up that much, but it's very definitely a nice nice tech to play, especially with Mega Freezer running around. And then my last three drop is a core is oops of course the four of the double striking Champa for the addition Champa because it's too good if I'm playing a red and a red aggress aggressive you gotta play that. On to the four drops, I am four costs. I'm playing Killer Sword Trunks just two because he's really good, but uh, it's kind of like. It's like, it's, it's, it's good, but I think two will suffice, fishing enough, it's great. I did, and, uh, he, he came, he really was really good today. He did really well. I brought back Amira, too strong. I played two Awakening Warrior Bardock. He's just a double, big 20,000 double striker. That's pretty nice, so. And then I wanted to play Super Saiyan 3 Bardock, so I threw him in here. I wanted to play three, but couldn't get three. I only got, I got trades, and I only get two. Uh, probably one of the cards I probably want to take out is Tobo, because uh, you know my Tobo is good, but he's um he's rolling his niche with this deck kind of because the gate you already have is already really good, but he never came up, so I could he's good, but I, I you could take him out. If, I guess, uh, I'm probably going to take him out for the super rare trunks from set 3. Um, yeah. And, uh, she's approaching third mass saying, uh, it's not a card you could probably take out. It's okay. But I'm going to take out for the, uh, three drop over them, three trunks from the, or from the older mass saying, which I don't own any of those two. So I probably would have pushed the deck over the edge, maybe I don't know, but it, they're good. I don't, I didn't own them. My locals keep selling out of the expansion sets, and so yeah, I can't really get them. So yeah, he's he's okay. He's, he's something. He's going to three costs if you have uh, seven or more warps. So I guess that's something. On to the five drops. To the Dimension Breaker Mira, who I never got to really play today. But he's just really good. Uh, double strike and really strong effect. You, yeah. Really, really powerful. There are 25,000 double strike with that cam. When you result, when you evolve, you have five or more cards in your warp. You choose one of your opponent's battle cards and send it to their warp. And if you have 10 or more, you get to send an energy. So you get to make your opponent lose an energy too. It's really, really powerful. And then Super Saiyan, uh, Three Bardock because Bardock's awesome. Super Saiyan three, three thousand triple strike that sends your entire all your opponent's battle cards to their warp, which is really good. Uh, I only use them once, and uh, it was to go and freeze the deck, and uh, he just had too many negates, so it didn't really matter. But you still both they're both really really good. They're really good uh, game winners, game changers. They, they really they really really help a lot. But well, sometimes you're not, you don't really reach that point. Then something that uh, I just play is why not Destruction Terror Trampa? Never use him. Never wanted to use him. Always want to use this basically there for energy and fodder. He's just, eh, you can take him out too. But he's also a name, so that's why I, I don't know the reason why I'm playing him. Then there's all the battle cards, most and extra cards. I'm not playing very many. Three dark plot because four is too much and three is perfect. Honestly, these cards are great. really, really great. Last card is the the negate. This card is insanely good. This card is so good. It's amazing. I love it. And yeah, so you gotta play four. If you're not playing four, what what's wrong with you? So yeah, that was the deck. Uh, hope you enjoyed. It's got second place. I got second place with this deck. Yeah, it's Britain Sticks really good. It's really fun. Very aggressive, very fast. Uh yeah. Hope you enjoyed this deck profile. This is Jeb. It's been a while since I uploaded a video. Yeah. This is Jeb saying goodbye and see y'all later. Yeah. If I want more super content and I have other decks, I can do deck profile as well. Uh just let me know. Uh yeah. And if you do op see openings or anything in the future but future, let me know in the comment section like this video if you enjoyed and uh
I will do an update if I want to see an update for this tech profile once I get more stuff. Yeah, so see y'all later. Jeb is out.